is Grace, and today I'm going to read the Bible story. Today's the Bible title is 31 chapter, The Brave Queen Esther. Let's read. Haman is going to kill the people of Israel, Uncle Mordecai said to the Queen Esther. What do you want me to do? said Esther. So, Israel... No. Uh, the Israel... I think we read this. Oh, we didn't. Um, Esther was very brave queen. And Paris, yeah. And one day his he was an Israel Jewish. But one day his cousin Mordecai said like Haman is going to kill all the Jewish No, oh, sorry. Please ask the king to help us, Esther said Mordecai. But Esther couldn't do it. Esther could not go to the king only when he wanted. Esther was an Israelite. She was the queen of Persian King Xerxes. Mordecai was a guard at the gate. Haman was the king chief. Helper. He hated the Israelites. He didn't know the queen was the Israelite. He planned to kill the people of Israel. So Queen Esther was Israelites, but he didn't tell the King Xerxes. And like suddenly Haman was going to kill Israelites because he really hated Mordecai. He ate, hated him so much because like he didn't bow to him. But oh I don't want to die, said Esther, but Esther loved her people. Queen Esther went to King Xerxes. Without his permission, the king welcomed her. So, like, there is a stick. It's the... Oops. <laughs> First <laughs> So, if King gives the stick to the people, then that people will not die. But King will come to. The king loved her. King Xerxes promised her Esther to do anything for her. Please help me. Help my people, said the queen Esther. A bad person is going to kill me and my people. He is trying to kill me. So the king so loved Esther, so like he said, what do you want? I will also give you the half of my kingdom, like that much. He said to him, I will do everything what you say. First time Esther said, like, come to a feast, like, not feast, and dinner, like, 
and he she sat in the dinner second dinner maybe that police help my people and me a bad people is going to kill my people and me, me and my people the king didn't like it the king loved Esther the king told Hammond to stop it Queen Esther saved her people Esther and her people were not scared anymore they were happy because of the brave Queen Esther 32 chapter Unchanging love of God. Job was goodly man. He served God very well. He didn't want God. Uh, he did what God wanted. God blessed him. So like, <laughs> he loved God. And so God blessed him. <laughs> Sad thing happened. Job servant ran to him. Bad people took our livestock. Job was sad. So like one day bad things were happening and yeah, bad people people took the live stock he was sad another servant came to job they killed the remaining live stocks they killed all the servants so like also also other like servants can't came and said like they killed the remaining livestock and they killed all the servants the other servant ran to dog your son is all dead job was very sad job prayed to god in tears naked i came from my mother's womb Naked I depart. The Lord gave and the Lord took away from me. I praise the Lord in spite of all these things. Job didn't sin or complain to God. So it suddenly also his son's dad they mm, sorry that <laughs> He was very like sad, and if I am him, like I will complain to God, but Job didn't do that. He said, "God gave me these, and God took it." Like, I praise the Lord. He didn't sin or complain. Job became sick after that. Satan did all these things to Job. Satan wanted Job to go away from God. But Job didn't go away from God. I will love God no matter what. I will always live, love God, said Job. Job... Love. Job loved God even in this pair. Job was loved by God even more. Job came to know more about God when he was suffering. Soon God healed him. Job and his sadness and pain. But he didn't leave God. God gave Job more cows, more sheep. God also gave them, gave him 
10 children. Yes, today I read the Bible story to the angel. And next time I'll read another God story. 33 chapter Daniel and the Perth, the King's Dream. Then let's see you next time. Bye.